Hello everyone, myself Mahesh Yadav. I am currently pursuing my MSc Chemistry from IIT Bombay. And today with us we have Sachin Rana. He is also a BS student from IIT Bombay. Let's ask about let's ask something about himself. Yeah. So hello everyone. My name is Sachin Rana. I am presently a third year undergraduate here. I am pursuing my BS Chemistry and one of their batchmates. So I cleared JE in 2016. So this was about me and I also run a YouTube channel which has over 100k subscribers right now uh, similar to them providing free education So Sachin Rana just tell us about your experience that how you prepared for IIT JE and all Yeah, that's uh, actually a very cliche question But to be honest like I wasn't one of those students who had a very good brain or something like that But I was one of those who had worked very hard during his preparation uh, my physics wasn't good because to be honest I didn't have that level of brain but for mathematics and chemistry I put my level best in order to uh, get the best preparation for these and qualify the JE advanced examination. So what do you think about coaching? Is it necessary for the students to talk or it's like we can do self-study and all? Okay, that's uh, like... Uh, see, about this question I want to say that I feel sometimes that coaching is necessary uh, because the non-coaching students like sometimes they do feel inferior to the people who actually go to coaching but uh, due to the internet revolution and those things you can get all the coaching stuff at your doorstep only ghar pe baitho, AC ke andar, uh, laptop pe dekhte raho, sab. so that is quite chill right now the scene is quite good right now so non-coaching students can also perform better than the coaching students right now so basically your YouTube channel is there and you are studying Maths, Physics, Chemistry ke liye bhi hai. So what is the best strategy for Maths, Physics and Chemistry books and all? Okay, so for Mathematics I want to say that like you should practice honi Like jitna tum practice karo ge Mathematics ke upar, utna acha bante jaoge. Similar goes for Organic Chemistry Many people think that Organic Chemistry is ka hai, they cram it and they then don't get the good marks Jo advanced level questions hote hai, you would see that you need to require the mechanism Sab kuch aana chahiye So focus on understanding the things things instead of cramming the things okay like uh, physical chemistry ho gaya wo bhi mathematics si ho jata hai. so like physics and all these go hand in hand for physics i want to say that many people run after many books but please solve only the hc verma that was the biggest mistake that i did during my coaching that i didn't follow just one book but multiple books se piche bhagte raha aur us chakkar mein mera wo result kharab ho gaya physics mein so that is the thing which i want to say chemistry ke liye for specially inorganic ncrt padhna bahut zaruri hai people miss the basic things they go for the higher level things basic ko miss kar dete hain na higher level samajh aata hai na basic rehta hai so that is the thing which you need to understand for the inorganic chemistry also Okay, and what do you think about the books of Maths, Physics and Chemistry and also for NEET if you have any idea about Biology and <laughs> For Biology I don't have any idea <laughs> but for uh, Mathematics I want to say I followed, for Calculus I followed Sengage uh, you can follow the Sengage series for most of the part, parts in Mathematics but uh, not for Vectors 3D, Vector 3D chapter I didn't uh, find that book to be good for Vector 3D otherwise it's very good uh, during the J advanced period you can solve the black book okay that is uh, known to many people that is a very popular book uh, for the J people uh, for chemistry uh, inorganic ke NCRT kafi hai for physical chemistry also like previous equation paper kar lena, along with the coaching material that would be more than enough uh, for organic chemistry MH John bahut achhi book hai please wo karke jana for physics mere achhe marks nahi aaye the but fir bhi main ek recommendation dena chahta hu ki HC Verma please kar lena aur advance ke time pe agar time mile to it of try karne ki koshish kar lena yeah, physics is quite tough in advance also, yeah. so one should have a perfect, uh, I mean, what should I say, this thing, a command in physics, only that that, that helps a lot in IIT advance. And what do you think about uh, last time preparation, 15 days strategy, I mean, how they should do during mains as well as advance? So for the 15 days preparation, I want to say that like you 15 days mein kuch naya padke, toh hard nahi paoge. So like you should already study the things which you are good at. Like if you think that you are kinematics weak, then this time pe tumhe kinematics padne ki koi hai. Focus on the things which you are strong at. Don't focus on the 10% paper jo tumhe nahi aata hai, but focus on the 90% paper jo tumhe already aata hai. Okay, so that is the tip which I want to give from my side to the people preparing for okay. competitive. And what about test series and all? I mean, any student should join another test series or it is good for the self-study part to study books and solve the questions? Uh, see, for test series, I want to summarize it in a single line. Like, test series is a want. 
it's not a need basically you need to understand that stuff if you're already studying in a coaching then test series is not that necessary but if you're doing self study then test series would be necessary a test series kaise dekhne ka tum logo ko find the test series which has the maximum number of people because jab competition badega then you will, then only you will be able to see that tumhari rank kitni achhi aa rahi hai us uh, subject mein us test series mein basically एंड बेसिकली क्या होता है कि मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स ना फील इन डिप्रेशन ड्यूरिंग दिस प्रिपेरेशन बिकॉज आई वॉज द वन हु वॉज ऑल्सो डन हु ऑल्सो प्रिपेयर फॉर आई मीन आई टी जे एडवांस आई ऑल्सो फील डिप्रेस एट दैट मोमेंट वट शुड बी योर टिप्स फॉर दिस थिंग लाइक फॉर दिस मोमेंट लाइक टिप्स तो मैं कह दूँ बट ड्यूरिंग माई डिप्रेशन लाइक एवरी एस्पेरेंट फेसिस दिस थिंग समटाइम इन दियर लाइफ सो लाइक पीपल टेन टू ईट जंक फूड ड्यूरिंग दैट पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम लाइक बहुत सारा यस वो खा लेंगे लाइक डोंट ईट जंक फूड ड्यूरिंग दैट टाइम ओके दैट इज द थिंग विच आई रियलाइज बिकॉज दैट थिंग फोर्सेज यू टू स्लीप मोर एंड फिर तुम और डिप्रेशन में जाते रहो कि मैंने पढ़ाई नहीं की द बेस्ट थिंग टू द बेस्ट वे टू सप्रेस द डिप्रेशन बेसिकली ड्यूरिंग दैट पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम इज टू गो टू अ एरिया लाइक लाइब्रेरी एंड स्टडी देयर योर सेल्फ ओके दैट इज द थिंग विच आई कैन से इन ऑर्डर टू सप्रेस द डिप्रेशन ओके फाइन एंड दिस इज आई गेस मोर अबाउट आई टी जे एडवांस एंड ऑल वट अबाउट दिज ओलम्पिया टेस्ट एंड ऑल दिज आर ऑल्सो कंडक्टेड बाई सम इंस्टीट्यूट्स ना येस 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 ओलम्पियाड आर कंडक्टेड बाई आई एम ओ मेनी ओलम्पियाड्स आर देयर सो लाइक आई वुड से दैट कीप ऑन गिविंग द ओलम्पियाड्स बेसिकली ओके आई ऑल्सो क्वालिफाइड क्वालिफाइड द एस्ट्रोनॉमी ओलम्पियाड द फर्स्ट लेवल ऑफ दैट ओके सो लाइक दिस प्रोवाइड्स यून एक्सपोजर like the papers are not that hard in comparison to the je ones but they provide you an exposure ki like kaise kaise tumhe preparation karna hai like they uh, make uh, sure ki tum kaun se areas mein weak ho kyunki ye jo olympiads jo hote hain wo je se bahut pehle hote hain so that make sure ki tum kis topic mein weak aur kis topic mein strong ho taki tum uske upar hard work kar sako and tell us some tips about ki students ko zyada silly mistakes na karni padhe i mean there har subject ke andar there is a point that students usually do that silly mistakes so yes. this helps so silly mistakes ke liye i want to say like uh, every mistake is a blunder basically it's not silly okay we can summarize in that line uh, it was said by my teacher like ya to tumhara plus 4 aayega ya to minus 2 aayega like agar tum mistake karoge to us cheez ko dhyan rakho agar tum ek question sahi kar rahe ho do galat kar rahe ho so it neutralizes the plus 4 which you have actually got okay so you need to understand that thing that every mistake is a blunder nothing is silly basically okay so we had a lot more discussion about this all and now obviously that basic thing that our channel is it beneficial for the students i mean we have we have just made this channel for those students who are weak in any kind of problem any kind of issues that the any kind of issue that they are facing during preparation of iit je as well as jam so what do you think about this thing yes uh, i find it useful basically the people who are providing uh, education on youtube and like all other platforms like all are doing good work basically because like it takes a lot of effort in order to make the videos that i can understand from everyone who is making the videos okay so it is definitely beneficial for all the people who are watching it okay thank you so much welcome the test series i mean they should join some other test series also or or in the coaching if they are having their coaching then they are doing from like bansal and kota uh-huh. so what should they do see for test series i want to uh, summarize it in a line like uh, test series is a, a need like a test series ye wala cut ho sakta hai kya ye wala koi issue nahi kar sakta ye wala question bar bar jayega theek hai nahi are koi nahi 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 hai main apne sath test series previous year questions okay फाइन हाँ हाँ ठीक है सो सही है ना तू क्या बोल रहा था ठीक है सारी में आई है क्या फिर वो तो इतनी नीचे क्यों आई है बे ऊपर तक रखी हो मैं लाते तो नहीं दिख रही है इसका मतलब इसका भी सब शॉर्ट सा रहा होगा ये हल्का सा ये दिख रहा है बल्कि बाकी ठीक है फाइन भाई बोलना चाहिए था यार चल कोई नहीं होता अब कोई नहीं वे बहुत इशू हो जाए चल कोई नहीं मेरा क्या ओके देन कितना हो गया इसको रख इसके बाद सब लास्ट बजे तेरा ये आ रहे बेटी पूछ लिया मैंने कोचिंग वाला हो गया हाँ कोचिंग नेसेसरी हो गया तो बस ये पूछ लो लास्ट पूछना है ये हो गया ये हो गया आर्यभट्ट हाँ क्या हमारा चैनल चैनल आर्यभट्ट लोगों के लिए हेल्पफुल है क्योंकि